Hi! It is 8.49 a.m. on Tuesday the 8th of October and it is time for today in my boo journal. So how are you? Are you alright? Um, before I go any further, Daryl did a quick video for all this morning so I'm just going to put that in here um, because he knew he would be at school when I was going to record. We didn't have time to record before we left for school this morning so yeah I'm going to check that in here. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Hi. We're just doing a quick flip through for Blue Journal, but I have something to show you right now. What do you have? Batman Bill, Iron Man, and another Bill with Fast Spider Man. A Spider Man? Wow. They're cool, aren't they? They're all Avengers. Well, they're not, but, but okay. The, the Batman's ba not an Avenger. Batman's DC Comics. He's Justice League. And what's this one? That's just a car, isn't it? Well, this one could be Avenger. Is he going to be in the Avengers, is he? Yeah. Okay. He's Spider-Man's car. Is he Spider-Man's car now? That's cool. I didn't know Spider-Man needed a car. Okay. But Austin has a car for Spider-Man. Austin's got a car for Spider-Man. Well, that's cool, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And he has a big dragon. And there's a no dragon. Right, are you going to say bye-bye to YouTube? But we did not do 10 hours. <laughs> we didn't do 10 hours. We're not doing 10 hours. <laughs> right, come on, do your bit and say goodbye. So put your thumbs up. Uh -huh. Leave us a comment because we love comments. What else? What else? What do you think? Click the bell and you'll be subscribed. And then you hit the bell and subscribe down below. You know if I should want to get new, new content. And you've got to say bye. But, but we had to do. Oh, kisses. kisses. Mwah. So don't forget to do all of that at the end of this video, will you, you know, and I will remind you, but, you know, just because he says you must do it, then you must do it. Don't forget. So how are you all? Are you all okay? Um, I did my night care last night. I think I've got a smudge on my glasses. It's really annoying me. Of course, you can't see it when you look at it because, you know, you need your glasses on to be able to see your glasses. <laughs> ah, that's better. Well, just suddenly clear a place. Right, I did my night care last night. I did that last night. Now, let's see, what did we get? What we got? 25,670. Well, I'm quite pleased with that. 10.13 miles. Um, I didn't mop last night. I went straight to bed. I was so, so, as soon as this finished, yesterday's video finished uploading, I just, that's it, I just went to bed. I, like, I just, yeah. <laughs> so, we are all up to date, aren't we? So let's change the pen out. Day face cream and makeup are a yes. Let's pull a card. The devil. Lead me not into temptation. Daryl's been touching my pens because they're all in the wrong order. We must have been because I haven't put them in that order. Um, <laughs> I've just looked over my pens and I'm like, hang on, they're not in order. Because I keep my pens in a certain order so that I can um, just pull them out quickly. Hmm, just keep an eye on that. Um, yeah, the devil is basically temptation. Um, you can see here you've got this nice young couple who are, you know, quite happy and all that lot. But their eyes are being pulled away from each other, from, from their own cats even, uh, by this this being that is offering them everything that they think they want. In his case it's money, in her case it's treats, you know, it could be power, it could be all of that. Have you been offered something lately? Is somebody trying to turn your head maybe? I would question their motives behind it um i i would be wondering whether they are genuine i've put is someone offering you something if it seems too good to be true 
it probably is. That is all filled out. Okay, so sleep last night. Sleep last night was awesome. I was in bed and asleep by half past nine last night. So I've already apologised to April, but I will apologise again. There was no way I could have done your life last night, darling. I was bamboozled, quite frankly. I didn't even want to get up this morning, but yeah, look at that. I was in bed at half past nine. I reckon I was probably asleep by quarter to ten. I don't think I've gone to bed that early in a long, long time. And other than a little bit of shifting around, I didn't even get up for the toilet throughout all of that I don't think oh you know I did once did I you know I'm not sure but I don't think I did I remember getting up but I'm pretty sure that was the night before and I slept right through until my alarm went off at half past six and that was an awesome sleep I felt like wow when I woke up it was just like dude I want to go back to that sleep because that was amazing so hungry today. I pigged out last night before I went to bed. I was having one of those I'm going to eat the fridge moments like you do and um, yeah I just got really hungry and I ended up eating like everything in the house. Well not everything but all the snacks <laughs> which was just like uh, now I need to go buy more snacks. I wouldn't mind, but of course all the snacks I ate were all the unhealthy ones. I just had a real carb craving going on. But I still only stuck to one can of cola, which, you know, I am proud of myself for that. Right, so that is all uh, up to date. Let's see, where are we up to today? Tuesday. I have cleaned the loo and I've checked the laundry. I don't have enough for a full load just yet. I need to go and buy another pair of jeans at some point because, you know, chub rub is a thing and they've gone in the, in, in the legs because of my big thunder thighs the dog has got a haircut today so I'm not going to get shopping today I might pop to Matalan tomorrow on the way home because my mum finally got another appointment for the low vision unit yay that's tomorrow at 1.30 so I've got to get Carl's, Kyle is picking up Daryl from school for me because there's no way we'll be back in time because that appointment will be at least an hour. And I am chocker all day tomorrow, so I might have to go to the shops tomorrow on the way home from that appointment. So let's jump through. Oh, yeah, we're in the card today, aren't we? That's nice. Okay. I might use that one today, being as we're in the card, just because it's a slightly smaller one. I am going to have to go and get some food in a minute. I'm starved. Office. Uh, net office. Uh. So as you can see, there's a little bit of everything. So again, let's draw a big cloud. A little bit of rain. High of 17 and a low of 12. So 7.15 was sunrise. Don't I know it? and 6.28 was sunset. Now, I know that today's picture is candy and the writing is black cats. So I will sketch them up in a little while and then um, I will do that in the evening edition tonight. Rant of the day, because I do have one. Um, might make this a regular thing. <laughs> when Daryl was in preschool, we had an app called Tapestry and it was the way for the school to communicate with the parents, notify them of things. The newsletter came via Tapestry and, you know, things like um, Sports Day, we were notified via Tapestry. When he started preschool, they said, oh, we don't use Tapestry. So I was like, oh, so we're not going to get random photos. Photos and stuff are posted on Facebook. You have the right to refuse to allow your child's picture to go on there. But if not, you you can find pictures on Facebook. There's a few of Daryl, which is nice. So I dropped him off today. And um, Marie, friend, uh, friend of my son's, she went to school with Matthew. And she's got a little boy in Daryl's class. 
said to me, oh yeah, it's photo day today. And I'm like, excuse me? And she said, yeah, it's photo day. And I was like, I didn't know this. I said, there's nothing up in the in the classroom foyer. Now in the, in the morning, we drop them off at the door and the teacher takes them in. In the afternoon, we go into the foyer, which is where so far newsletters have been. Um, there's a form where you can write down what time you want to have a chat with the teacher, which I think is in a week or so. And, and you know, lost property, lunch boxes and stuff like that. It's, we, we line up and we all go into the foyer one by one to pick up our children. Well, there's been nothing in there about school photos or anything. So I was like, I didn't know about this. She said, oh, it's on the app. I said, what app? There's an app where I can pay for things like, um, you know, he's, he's allowed... Um, donations towards snack money that kind of thing um if there's a school trip i put it's all done via the app the school don't take money they won't take cash which is i personally think is brilliant but yeah so it's all done via the app so i was like what app and i pulled over and i opened it she said no not that the other app i said what app so she pulled it up showed me she said look it's here and i was like i didn't know about this and i'm fucking livid I, I even stopped the teacher. I went back to the classroom and said to the teacher, look, I didn't know that there was a photo today. And I said, apparently it's on the app. And she said, right. I said, but there's two apps. And she said, is there? She didn't even know. And I said, no. I said, it wasn't up in the foyer. I said, but apparently it is on the app. I said, now I've just downloaded the app. I said, and you know, I said, look. And I showed her, I actually set it up in front of her. And she was like, oh, oh, okay. She said, well, I'll tell the office. But I'm fucking livid because he's been there a month. And it makes me wonder if I've missed anything else important. Do you know what I mean? Not one single person at the school told us. About, I don't know how Marie... I think Marie said she overheard somebody else talking about it. And I'm like, but not one official person said to us, oh yeah, there is another app. There's the app where you pay for stuff. And then there's the other app. And it's got everything on this app. It's got... Um, <clears throat> let me pull it up. I'm not going to show you because obviously it shows things about the school. There's there's two calendars. One of them, it takes you to the school, um, to the 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 school calendar that's on their website, yeah. And then there's another one where it's just a basic, and there it is, look, individual photos all day. The only place that that's written is on this fucking app. There's uh, a link to the website. There's a link to their Facebook. It's not on their Facebook either. Um, there's a link to news. Donkey Sanctuary Harvest Festival on the 6th of October. I missed it because I didn't fucking know because it's on the app. School dinner Thursday the 3rd of October. Please encourage your child to try our all-time favourite hot dogs and crumble meal. Jack of potatoes will also be available on this day as per usual. Do you know what your child is doing online? You know, all of this stuff. I have missed free event coming up. In the year the Isle of Wight became a UNESCO biosphere, Santa Bay became Britain's best beach. There's never been a better time to explore 100 million years of Bay wildlife. La -di -da -di -da. Sunday, 13th of October. Oh, well, I haven't fucking missed that one then. Free event from. Okay. Domestic Abuse Awareness Campaign. Oh, that was before the holidays, so I wouldn't have known about that. Free sanitary products. This is good. This is news that we should be, able, you know, we should know so that we can tell our children. Regent Pharmacy in Shanklin now offer a service to provide free sanitary products to women and girls who cannot afford to buy them. Products will be provided by the kind donation of staff and customers. If you wish to use this service or donate a product, please ask a member of staff. I didn't know they were doing that. This is, you know, this is the kind of thing that even our news pages aren't putting that kind of shit up. Well, that's good because I've got a packet of tampons over there that I don't use because I've switched to the menstrual cup and I've been wondering what to do with them. Because, and everybody goes, I'll donate them to your local shelter, but I can't find any information about my local shelter. I, I found an email address, I think it was, and I emailed them and I never got a response, so, you know. I'm livid. I'm livid that there's all this information. Contacts. Well, there's just that's just the school. But there should. I think the family liaison officer should be on there. 
because you know that's important info what's in that then more information look curriculum grids this is this is just silly there's all this stuff and I don't know anything about it documents nothing in the documents app feedback <sighs> well, that's just for the app, that's not for the school. The only trouble is it seems to be that you can only link one school to it. Which is like, mm, what if you've got a second child? I don't know, can you add another school? Oh yeah, there you go, you can add in another school. There you go, just by hitting settings, which is that's about, that's about all you get. Notifications. When news is added, when events added, when information home added, events reminders. And that's it. It's a very basic app, but again, there's info in there that I knew nothing about. That's infuriating. I'm sorry, but it is. And as a parent, especially technically a new parent, because even though my older children went to the, the, the school in question, it although it had the same name, it was in a different building, the internet wasn't really a huge thing for that kind of info. They had email and that was about it. There was no Facebook page. There was no none of that crap. Do you know what I mean? Even though everybody had Facebook and all of that lot. Um, businesses weren't doing it as much. Everything was done via, the, via a school newsletter, which was released out every week or whatever. So this is all new to me. And it's really annoying when the school are not forthcoming. So there you go. So that's my rant for the day. <laughs> that's it. It's over. I can't. I can't. I feel. <sighs> I feel all calm now. <laughs> we might have to make that a regular thing. Is there anything you wish to rant about? Is there? Is uh, let's 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 make it a, a a a dear. In in the UK, we have a newspaper columnist. Everybody knows who she is. She's called Dear Deirdre. And you write in and you you tell dear Deirdre your problems and she tries to fix them for you. So like you write in and you say, I'm, I'm going to have my husband's brother's baby. What do I do? And she'll usually tell you to come clean and that kind of thing. So, so let's have a dear Sam section. Is there anything that you are having issues with or problems with or you just want somebody to talk to? You know, I've, I've said this a few times before. You are always, always welcome to email me if you have a problem. Uh, my social media links are down below. You can PM me on any of those. But is there something that you want to discuss? You can do it anonymously by hitting the social media links or you can put it in the comments and we'll discuss it in tomorrow's or a future. If it doesn't come up by the time I film tomorrow's, it can come up in a future one. That might be quite good. It's like a little bit different, yeah? spice this up a little bit i feel like i do the same crap over and over again the only thing that's different is what pictures i draw and what calligraphy i write um no nina it was a car not an ambulance but i couldn't see it because i'm high up off the road and there's a wall in the way um yeah so you know let's have something a little bit different something we can discuss maybe and if it's a really huge subject, we could save it for the lives. So, yeah. Right. I'm going to go <sighs> and find food because I'm absolutely starving. And, um, yeah. I will be back for the evening edition. Take it easy. Have a good day. Hi, welcome back. Um, right, my mind's a bit frazzled. I've been working out my book for next year because we're going to make it in the live tomorrow. So I printed off an entire pack of Tommy River paper because I wasn't sure how many sheets I would need. And then I must have counted about seven times to make sure I've got the right amount of fucking sheets. So I really, really hope I do if you're interested i have got 61 sheets here um i've even like i've even written notes on them like july calendar and you know oh god 
Yeah, it says October calendar, but I think that's wrong. I hope that's wrong because I just, yeah, that's September. It's got a tick on it then that I've double checked it and it's correct. <laughs> but so, yeah, basically, that is going to be the thickness of the planner section next year. So, uh, it's not going to be too thick, which I don't know, I was kind of shocked at, you know. So, I'm going to run this alongside the junk journal side of things and um yeah i was thinking of copic stitching it because i thought it was going to be horrendous but at 61 sheets of bash it's only really going to be four signatures of 15 which isn't going to be much chunkier than the book i did for august and september so i think i might just do it that way and leave copic stitching for another time there is another thing i want to do with copic stitching and that's callie's make a like a sketch pad for Cali, a lie flat one. So I might leave it for then, sort of thing. Okay, right. Let's. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay, let's go here. The challenges are ready and just have to be drawn in. I've not had any booze. There's been one can or less. I've not had chips. I have crafted as such and I need to do an about today. I haven't really done anything today, I've just sort of been at home. My mood is about there. My pain is about there. It's not too bad but got cramp going off in my leg at the minute which is giving me a bit of shit um we'll do that in the morning okay tuesday i didn't oh, i've got to put the bins out oh um daryl's table i gave it a wipe over dishwasher is full but not yet on so i'll do that in a moment I'll check the cupboard in the fridge and put the bins out, which I'll do that in a minute. I've just been waiting for Daryl to go to sleep. I still haven't done the WWE spread for last week's main event. Right. Well, this week's main event that was on Sunday night, rather. So there we go. That was done. Right. So let's jump to today. So I got happy mail today. Um, I was going to do a separate video, but it's not very long because it was only one parcel. Um so yeah i'm just going to set that in here i think it should make this one a slightly longer video but what the hell have a look at this hi hi, hi. we are just gonna tilt that a bit we are going to open some happy mail now um i didn't know who this was from because i actually didn't look at the label i just opened it and i found out it's from mary thank you darling i really really appreciate it and i opened but, it thanks and mary. then i was like oh hang on that's obviously not for me oh. so i waited for daryl to come home from school before i opened any more of it i'm ready you ready well i think that red one might be for you Wow. Wow. Hang on, let me make it let me make it big so everybody can see you. Yay, Paw Patrol! <laughs> <laughs> hang on, hang on. Who's on the bag? Spider Man! Spider Man! And I have some Paw Patrol. Wow. What's that then? Oh, it's a puzzle. Who's them? Sky and Chase. Sky and Chase. What else do I have? What else do you have? You have... Stickers. Stickers for your boo journal. And another bag. Who's that? Vengeance. Vengeance. So you've got two bags to store all your stuff in. Aren't you lucky? Mum. Yeah. Can I have Sky and Chase open? You want Sky and Chase open? <laughs> We're going to have to tidy your room up to make room for all this new stuff you keep getting. Right, you take your two bags. Take your bags. Mum? Yeah. I'm going to leave them over there. Leave them over there, are we? Yeah. And we'll use those next time we go shopping, shall we? Yeah. 
or so. Where's Chase? In my hand. There you go. Drink stickers as well. Yeah? You're going to say thank you? Thank you. <laughs> I'll put the puzzle on the other as well. Right, I think the rest is for me. So yeah. you go and watch your thing. Bye, Mum. See you later. Go on then. See you in a bit. I'm just going to put Paw Patrol on. Alright, then you go and put Paw Patrol on and watch it. It's a one with super pups. Ah, one with super pups, no less. Aren't you happy that you now know that? So, what else did we get? Well, ooh, a new stencil. Lovely. Ooh. I'm going to just pull it all out in one go and we'll go through it. <laughs> she brought me some blades for my punch boards spare blades awesome thank you i will probably lose these I'll, i should i should put them away somewhere safe what are these a stencil wheel that's a bit cool oh i see oh these are oh hang on um uh, mm, 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 yeah so you've got a little Grim Reaper. A sort of scarecrow type thing. Where'd you put it? Let me put it that way. It says boo. You've got, basically there's loads of different designs. I should have to draw these up. These look like fun. I should show me a couple. Wow, these are so cool. You've got a trick or treat. You've got a cat in a hat, witch's hat. You've got a skeleton in a coffin. You've got a ghosty. <laughs> These are awesome, Mary. These are really, really cool. I've never seen these before. These are different. These are awesome. I'm sure, we can come up with something for those. <gasps> doilies! Ah! Oh my gosh, doilies! Yay! I've been after doilies for a while. She knows I wanted doilies. Oh, there's all different ones. Oh, that's awesome. And I got the tape off without ruining the little envelope. There's a little envelope. I can't get hold of it because my hands are dry. I've just got Daryl out of the bar. Never forget how great you can. Oh, thank you. That's awesome. If you can't use something, please feel free to give it to someone else. There are two bags, two toys, one pack of stickers, and one puzzle for Daryl. We hope you enjoy the stuff. Love April and Mary. You guys are so awesome. Thank you. I'm going to stick this in my journal. This is going to get stuck in my journal because it's fab. I don't even know what I've done with my journal because I'm printing paper for the live. There it is. Um, stick it in the top there. <gasps> doilies! Look at all these doilies you guys sent. I've been after doilies for ages because they just look so decorative and shit. And messy. So we've got these ones. These are lovely. I got one very very similar in fact it's almost exactly the same on this year's calendar that Daryl did in preschool for me at the end of last year but it's pink here's one hang on I'm just going to move you so that you can see up there on the wall that was a calendar that he made for me in preschool and it's almost exactly the same as this heart doily that is so so awesome Then we've got these ones. They've got like little roses in the in the bits there. Gosh, look at all the different designs. Oh my god, you guys. That's nice. They look like we pumpkins. It's a pumpkin doily. Wow, you got there's loads in here, you guys. 
Oh, these are so nice. Oh, they come in all different... Oh, these are the same design as these ones, but bigger. Oh, that's so freaking cool. Oh, those are like... Those are like picture frames. You know? You know the oval um, picture frames that you get? Jesus, my hair is like poofy. Um, those are so cool. And then a big version of the pumpkin styles. These are awesome. Thank you. I'm going to have so much fun with these. Oh, I love that you've got like a little embossed flower all around there. The little ones don't have that. Oh, thank you so much. These are really nice. It's like big ones and little ones of each design. That is awesome sauce. Yay. Oh, I want to play. And then my overly ones, these are, wow. There, there's going to be doilies in my journals now. Just to fucking look pretty, if nothing else. Oh, hey, you got this from Tuesday morning. Now, I've heard a lot about this store. But only recently. Is it a new store? I'm covered in little bits of doily now. Is it a new store? Because I'd never heard of it up until a couple of weeks ago. Oh, that's brilliant. Thank you so much. Daryl's well trust. He's gone away with his toys and turned Peter Rabbit off and put Ball Patrol on instead. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, that's... It's brilliant. Thank you so much for the goodies. I really appreciate it. I don't know what I'm going to do with these yet. But I will find something. Better ass, I will. I love that you can hang them up as well. I think that's really good. Really good. You can spray through them, paint through them. Brilliant. What a good idea. Fantastic. Thank you, you two. I really, really appreciate my little package of goodies. There is something on its way to Mary. Um, I didn't put anything in for April because I didn't know what to get her. So, Mary, honey... Thank you. It was short and sweet and it was brilliant. <laughs> I really made my day. Thanks very much, guys. I'll see you later. Bye. Isn't that fab? <gasps> there's my little, there's my thing to say that it had been left in a safe place and this was the little card that Mary and April sent me. So I'm going to stick this. I'm going to stick this in. I think I will make that a flap and then stick this to that bit like so and then this ends up being like an extra page because I can put something on the back of that if necessary. I'll just leave it, I don't know. Let's get a new glue stick soon because I'm sure this one's running out. Trouble is, unless you get one that's got a clear tube, how do you know when your glue stick's about to run out? You don't really, do you? But mine leans like when I eject it. And it only goes that far now. It won't go up anymore. So I reckon... Yeah, see, it's not going back down. I reckon... I am... Yeah, I am at the end. So I need a new glue stick. So I shall have to go sharpen. There we go. Look at me sticking shit in with my washi. There's not a lot of it on this page, just enough to sort of hold it. Okay, right, so let's get a pen and draw some candy. I'm 
really enjoying using the gouache. It's really cool. Okay. There we go. Put a little heart stamp on there. The ink was really gungy, that's why I had to wipe it off. That's why I sort of stopped. Uh, did a bit of journaling in the card. So that is now ready. I can jump onto this page tomorrow. So I'm probably gonna journal that sideways. Although I don't know. I might just go straight across it. I haven't decided. That's the good thing about it. So my um, words were happy mail. The one that I had to click for you was black cats and we did some candy for the spooky girl challenge. Okay, right, I am gonna leave it there because I am bloody tired, really, really tired. I'm gonna go and, it's only nine o'clock, I don't know what's the matter with me. I'm gonna go and have my bath while this is uploading and I'm gonna to go to bed and um, yeah that'll be it for today there will not be a today in my bujo tomorrow because it's Wednesday tomorrow and I'll be going live we will tomorrow set up week 42 yeah, we'll set up week 42. I'll have to get some washi. All right, that'll go here. And then I'll get on and I'll start stitching that book together. You get to see the whole thing. You get to watch me fold all the pages. You get to watch me put it together. You get to watch me sew it together. You get me to watch me cut the cover up, and put that on and all of that. It's gonna be the whole thing from start to finish. The only thing you don't get to watch is me print the dot grid up because I've already done it because I knew it would take a while. But yeah, other than that, it's already. So I'm gonna leave that there so it stays nice and flat. Thank you so much for watching. Please feel free to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave me a comment down below. Click the book and you will be subscribed. And if you hit the bell that then appears down below, you will be notified, <laughs> YouTube willing, when I upload new content. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really, really appreciate it. And I do appreciate all interaction with you. I uh, hope you have a fantastic rest of your day and I will see you on Wednesday's live, 7.30 UK time. I believe that's about 2.30 Eastern, something like that. Um, yeah, and I'll see you then. Take it easy, guys. <laughs>